Hi there, my name's James, and in this video I'll be briefly outlining the sound I created for Blip Sound's March 2020 sound design competition. Here's the clip they tasked us to redesign. This month, the one rule of the competition was that we were only allowed to use one single sound source to redesign the whole scene, so I made an asset list. This allowed me to focus in on the details of the clip and really brainstorm ideas of what source I was going to use. And you ask, what source did I settle on? The Hoover. So I grabbed my trusty shotgun mic and an XLR and recorded my source. Then I started building my sound layer by layer. I started with the sound of the force. This layer was meant to sound evil and weighty. I used a fair amount of pitch shifting and reverb to create a bassy layer, along with a lot of compression, tremolo, reverb, chorus, etc, etc. This is what I ended up with. Next, the lightning. This layer demanded a ton of distortion, bit crushing, fuzz and compression. I automated a few layers just to give the electricity a sense of movement by shifting overall pitches and formants. Along with these automated layers, I had a background static layer bulking out the mids and a weighty bass layer to even out the piercing highs of the distorted automation. Finally, I wanted some subtle whooshes. Whooshing? Wind noises. This was the easiest layer to create as the hoover, by design, already produces airy sounds. However, I didn't like the result of just adding reverberated sucking to the overall sound. Ha ha ha. <laughs> so I added more bit crushing and this is the result I got. And here's what happens when we combine all this together. And why not? Let's make a quick spaceship ambience to fill it all out. I hope you like my design everyone. This is my first ever entry into the competition, and hopefully not my last. I've left a link to the Blip Sounds YouTube channel and website in the description below for anyone interested in starting sound design or participating in coming up competitions. That's all from me, see you next time.